Hey guys. Hi. Zach and Bree here. So Bree just picked me up from school mm -hmm. and it is dinner time. We wanted to record another video of us, meaning Bree, cooking a HelloFresh dinner. Tonight we'll be cooking chicken fajitas. So we are excited about that and it sounds really good. If you guys are interested in trying HelloFresh for yourselves, I will leave a link in the description below and you guys can click it and sign up using our code. It mm -hmm. will give you a 40 dollar off your first purchase yeah and also stay tuned because later tonight after dinner we are going to use our new hoyer lift and show you guys how that works and how Bria has been transferring me into bed using the lift so yeah all right here we go <laughs> for moral support. Yeah. Okay. okay, so I forgot to record all my cut up vegetables, but I just threw them in and then with the spice I gave me, you gave up. So now the veggies are cooked. Oh, okay. And the cream is made. Yeah. Okay, so Brie just seasoned the chicken with salt and pepper on both sides. And now she is cutting them in strips. And then we are going to cook them. This is my favorite thing to do, right? Favorite so. part? You love the feeling of raw, that. uncooked chicken between that. your fingers? <laughs> she hates this part. I can't. You can't. Oh, my. in the the ducks with your mitten oh, okay. So we just put some jalapenos on a couple Jal of them. Oh my gosh, you said it so badly. How are you supposed to say it? Okay. Yeah, you can't even say it. <laughs> so this is the final product. I actually already ate one because it was so good. And Brie is still working on her first one. Yeah. How do you like it? It's good. It's good. Yeah. I haven't tried the jalapenos yet. They're actually really good and flavorful. It's probably one of my favorite HelloFresh dinners and I am yeah, excited to try and eat the rest of these so hope you guys liked watching Brie cook that quick HelloFresh meal if you guys are interested in trying it for yourself click the link below and sign up 
and we will see you guys next for bedtime and Hoyer lift. Hey guys, so Bree and I ended up not recording our nighttime routine the other night, hence me being in different clothes. It ended up getting too late, so we decided to do it tonight. And this is the Hoyer lift that we got with all of your donations. Again, I just wanna say thank you, or Bree and I both wanna thank everyone that donated to help get this. It has been making our lives so much better and it's helped a lot with Bree's back. So this is the sling that it came with and I'm gonna show you how Bree gets it behind my back and underneath me and how she hoists me in the air and gets me in my bed. So here we go. So first step is we have to fold back my armrests and pull out my side guards so we can get the sling down my back and underneath me completely. Right now. Yeah, I'm okay. Sure. <laughs> oh. yeah. At the end of the night, my body is always very tight yeah. and spastic. So, part of my quad belly. I just ate dinner. It's not usually this big, but. Okay. Oh well. Okay. So, I don't yeah. want to take off the seatbelt before. Okay. So, this is what the sling looks like. <laughs> and that will go down my back and underneath my butt and then Brie was going to come in front of me and pull it basically down. Yeah. Right? So everyone has a different way of doing this. So this is just yeah. our way. This is the way we found that works best. If mm -hmm. anyone else has other alternatives, please let us know. Just shove me forward. <laughs> I don't want you to fall out of your chair. Okay. Okay. So I'm sliding it behind his back and then... What's it called when you do that? Wiggling? Yeah. Just kidding. Um, and then I make sure there's a lot of extra slack. Then. This oh, is the fun part. I lift up this leg. Oh, don't kick out, please. Pull that side through. Honestly, this is saving my back a lot more than. Perfect. And I can feel my butt in that hole. So mm -hmm. usually when I can feel it, that means I'm nice and centered. So I, I don't think they can see, but there's a little handle and then you have to like open it to get around his chair. Yeah. So the legs open up. Yes. Right there. Make sure it's closed. This one. There's so many different versions, so. Yeah. I look forward to this every night. It's like a little ride before I get to go to bed. Yeah. All right. We got all four hooks on, the same color. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the same color as. That's important. There. All right, here we go. And this is like barely any work for me, yeah. the pumping. I like that. Baby in a sling. So I'm gonna just roll away. <laughs> Here we go. Hello. <laughs> that was really cute. I'm gonna sprinkle your leg out. And usually while I'm hanging over the bed right now, Brie will take off my shoes. It's just easier. <laughs> and then actually my favorite part is when I'm over the bed, I get to push the release button. <laughs> That is. By myself, and I get to lower myself. <laughs> okay, so I push this lever in. Whee! <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Now take off the 
handle straps. Yeah. On both sides. We are free. We are cool. currently in bed. Yep. That's it. Mm -hmm. All right, so now I'm in bed, and basically the next step would be Brie would just roll me over on my side and tuck one side of the sling in and roll me the other way and then pull it out from underneath me. So that's how we've been getting in bed using the Hoyer lift. And we're going to show you how we get from my bed into my chair in the morning. So thank you guys again to everyone who has donated for us to be able to get this Hoyer lift. Again, it's been a lifesaver. So we will see you in the morning. Hey guys, good morning. Bree and I just woke up and she just got me dressed. So we wanted to show you how she gets me from my bed back into my wheelchair using the Hoyer lift. So she's gonna roll me over and put the sling underneath my back and then use the Hoyer lift to lift me up and roll me back into my wheelchair. Yeah, feels good. Good. Bring it in the lift. Da, da. So Bree and I are getting up pretty early and we're gonna go to a SWAT meet this morning. So that'll be fun. All right, ready for the ride. I know. Gotta get your feet off. Gotta get my feet off. Oh. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Okay, so now I'm just going to push his knees back and then <laughs> um, and then some minor difficulties. Yes. Push his knee back and then open the lever slowly so I can keep continually pushing him back and then fine, he's Bam. good. You are on it real loud today. Yeah, that was a good one. Sometimes I'm like on the edge of my seat. <laughs> I know. And we have to lift you back up and push you back farther. Mm -hmm. Well, that was a good one. Thank you. Yeah. So I'm going to do the opposite of last night. Lift the leg up and then push it back. Yeah. Perfect. We're on. Alright. That slid out pretty good too. Yeah. Thank you. Can't forget the seatbelt because my spasms are so crazy, I could, I'll literally spasm out of my chair. Mm -hmm. Cool. Mm -hmm. Alright, and no more, no more quad belly. <laughs> my belly is back to being flat. But, yeah, so that's it for this video, guys. That's how Brie has been transferring me mm -hmm. to bed and out of bed back into my chair. Again, thank you so much for donating for us to be able to get this yes. lift and Thank has been you. saving Bree's back and although it takes longer it's a lot safer so yeah. 
Please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel if you already haven't. We will see you all in our next video. Thanks. Bye.